Hey guys, do you have this message on your device? Your phone was factory reset and to your pin to unlock it. This is the well known FRP lock. We're gonna click on use my Google account instead. And I'm gonna show you on this video how you can unlock the FRP in only a few minutes. So as you can see, this phone is locked. I need to verify it with my account, but of course I don't have the account. So I'm gonna show you how you can do it. So first go to safeunlocks.com, but before we start, you just need to open the website and everything is done on the website. So there is no need to download any type of software. Once you're on the website, go to services and over here, click on the FRP unlock. So you can see unlock any Android device from Android FRP lock. There is great resources down here. There is good information about this topic, but we're not gonna cover that on this video. Otherwise it will be really long. So we have to enter some information in order to unlock our device. So we're gonna start with our name. We're gonna proceed with our email. All right, now we have to select the device model we want to unlock. There are all the well-known brands in the market, but if you don't have any of these brands, you can choose any Android model. Uh, in this case, I'm gonna use a Samsung, with very well-known brand, and I have to select the IMEI. It's already there, and I have to enter my IMEI number. How can you get the IMEI number? You might be wondering, it is really easy. The first method is to go to the box of your device, if you have it, and you'll likely find it there. If you don't have it, go to the SIM card tray on your device, open it here, or SIM card, and there is a good chance that you're gonna find it there. The third option, and I know it works for most devices, is that you'll find it on the back of your device or somewhere there, your IMEI number. Over here, I have it right here, and we're gonna enter that IMEI number onto the form. So I'm gonna do that. All right, guys, I just finished entering my IMEI number. Make sure everything is correct that, because this is very important. Now, I have to click on the I asset the one dollar fee to sign up and unlock my device, and I have to click on the proceed button. Over here, you can see that you have an order ID. Well, this is my ID in this case, and I need to get a membership ID in order to activate it. But it says that there is a video down below that is gonna explain how to continue. So we're gonna go and do that. Please watch this video before you proceed to do anything. Hey, it's Jacob from Safe Unlocks. Your order with us is almost ready. All you need to complete it is obtain a membership ID. All right, as you can see, it's really quick. It's a really nice video, and we have to scroll up and as you can see, get membership ID. We're gonna complete the CAPTCHA over here. Click on the continue to sign up button. And as you can see, I got my sign up button right here. I'm not gonna show you this part of the process. So we're gonna see each other once we're done with this. So see you again in just one minute. Okay guys, I'm done completing my membership ID. It was a really simple process. And all we have to do now is to go to our email. Now, over here in the inbox, we have to wait for that membership ID. So let's give it a minute. All right, guys, perfect. I can see the email by Safe Unlocks membership ID. Let's open it up. It says, hey, Nick, thank you for using Safe Unlocks. Your membership ID has been verified. Please use it on the order page to get it started. Over here, I have the ID. So we're gonna copy this exact ID and we're gonna go to the order and over here where it says enter here to continue we're gonna paste it and if you did everything correctly you'll see the start order button it is as simple as that we're gonna press it and as you can see your order is now in progress now you might be wondering what you have to do now it is really simple they're gonna send us some login details where we're gonna enter it on the FRP device to unlock it so let's go back to the email and let's open the inbox over here and let's wait for that. Okay guys, perfect. FRP dummy ID. Let's open this email. Your FRP dummy ID was generated successfully. Please enter this ID on the device you have selected using the IMEI number. This dummy ID does not contain any type of personal data. We got an email and a password, so we're gonna tape off FRP lock device and we're gonna enter that same information that was sent on our email. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, I got the email and now let's enter the password. All right, let's make sure everything is correct. 
So you can see, same email, same password. And after that, we're going to hit on the next button. All right, over here, we're going to press on add previous account. And over here, don't copy. All right, account added. And all we have to do now is to hit next. Now, next over here, just say yes to this. That's it. And over here, skip. And skip anyway. You don't want to install any of these apps. And hit on OK. And over here, sign up to your Samsung account. We're gonna skip this, skip, and finish. All right, remind me later. And now we're on the home screen of this Android device. So all we have to do now, it's really simple. Go to settings, and all you have to do now, scroll down, accounts and backup, go to accounts, and over here I can see the dummy account, and we're gonna press remove account. Remove account. And that's all you have to do. It was really simple. So you can see this device is now fully unlocked from the FRP lock. If you want to do it yourself, remember, go to safeunlocks.com and you'll be able to do it in only a few minutes. And remember, you only need a browser and an internet connection. It is really simple. And we hope this video was really helpful for you. See you again on next video. Bye.